morning everyone. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Meg if you are new here. After four years I am free from college. I finished college. I'm completely done. I've spent the last two weeks with family and friends because I honestly just have not seen anybody in such a long time. So it was really nice to kind of catch up with people and see them but now I definitely need a little bit of recuperating but I'm just kind of letting myself enjoy some downtime at the moment. I have one or two work things to do but that's about it and it is a beautiful beautiful day today so i'm very excited but yeah welcome back i miss you guys i'm officially back every sunday baby It's glow up day. I'm getting my nails done and hopefully my hair done today, but I'm making a last minute appointment so I hope I get in. But yeah. Let's go. I flow, flow, flow downstream. I wanna flow. I don't know what to do with myself. I'm having like an identity crisis right now. Post-college identity crisis. It is currently like half seven in the morning and it's Thursday morning. I'm going to Dublin today, which is actually so exciting. I haven't really been thinking about it much, but I'm staying in Dublin tonight all by myself. I'm really, really looking forward to it. I love solo nights away. And even though like it kind of contradicts being an introvert, it kind of doesn't at the same time, because even though it's scary to travel on your own, traveling on your own lets you literally decide whatever you want, what you want to do for dinner, whenever you want to go home, you can just, make all those decisions yourself. And I love spending time with myself in my own company. So it's really nice, but I'm really looking forward to that because tomorrow I'm going to an award show with Dyson. I have to have like a bit of a pamper night tonight, get my tan on, get shaved, all that good stuff. I still don't fully have a dress because the dress I ordered kind of doesn't work with my hair, which kind of sounds ridiculous, but my hair is drastically lighter than it was when I ordered the dress and the dress is very pale. I don't know, I'm gonna have to try it on while I have like my tan and my makeup on. But anyway, I'm gonna talk to you all about that later. For now, I basically went pretty much blonde yesterday. It wasn't like fully intentionally the plan, but I think it's kind of cool. I think I really actually needed the change. I don't know, I think it's gonna be fun. It is just a little bit weird and like I'm having to like adjust to seeing myself in like the viewfinder here. But for now, I'm going to finish packing and get going because I'm going very early this morning. I'm gonna go straight to the hotel, leave my bags there and then just have a little wander around Dublin. I'm so excited. Are you ready for a solo? introverted trip because I am we don't need to get inside these broken highways we don't need a friend we don't need to get up from a heated arms race. We don't need a friend. Let's 
the solo stay commence. I have just checked into the hotel. Luckily enough, they had a room available because it's only like 11 in the morning, but yeah, they had a room available, so I'm all checked in and I'm so happy. I'm going to put a little bit of makeup on. It is the most beautiful day today in Dublin, so I want to get out and enjoy it and I just have a bit of a nosy through the shops. This is like the best you've just finished college present to myself and I'm so happy. Okay, I'm gonna go get some makeup on. Let's go see something. but I'm gonna go do more shopping now. Hello everyone, it is currently, I think it's about half eight at night. I have just eaten, I'm back in the hotel room. I had such a wholesome, gorgeous day. I spent the last year longer of college just like wanting to be able to I just, I just broke my camera. My camera's broke. I've just broken my camera. Okay, the setup is so awful, but it's gonna have to do. I'm not gonna talk for long because the lighting is so bad. But yes, as I was saying, I was just so happy. I did lots of little things that I absolutely loved. Went to a bookshop, got some food, chilled in the park, got a donut. It was just... I also bought a dress for tomorrow and I actually really like it. A little bit nervous because I'm quite like body conscious at the moment which isn't like a nice feeling. I'm really putting myself out there tomorrow because it's like an award show red carpet kind of thing and that's a little bit scary but for now I'm going into the shower, I'm scrubbing myself, shaving, putting on tan, doing all that jazz hopping into bed and getting a good night's sleep. I have my hair appointment with Dyson in the morning at 12 and then I get my makeup done after that. <laughs> what is my life right now? Anyway, this has truly been one of the best solo days I've ever had. And I'm about to have the best solo evening. Oh my God, this light, this is horrific. I actually can't put you through this any longer. The lighting's too bad. Okay, I'm so excited. Good night. Bring down all the lights, let me hold you close. Good morning, everyone. I have woken up excited, terrified, scared, excited, and I'm all tan. I did my little beauty routine last night, it was very lush, but now I'm running down to get some breakfast. And then I'm going to get my hair done with Dyson. They're also doing my makeup, which is kind of crazy. But yeah, let's go. I'm ready to go. I have my makeup and my hair done and I honestly have been sitting in bed the last hour in this blue dress over here and everyone kept being like wear the blue dress and by everyone I mean like family and friends they were like the blue the blue brings out the color of your eyes and they were all correct however 
there was just like a feeling in the pit of my stomach that I just didn't feel good. I didn't feel like myself and I think the dramatic makeup doesn't like fully help but the dress just didn't fully fully give me um, and I've gone for a dress that's kind of I think color wise people will be like eh but I don't care <laughs> I'm really comfortable um, and I feel good now and I'm gonna get going but yeah a quick look over my dress I promise I'll get some good photos that I can show you guys but for now this is the back of her this is the dress I'm wearing. It is rented for the night from Droby and it's originally from the Australian brand it's called Dish. I really, really love it. I think it's so cute. And it also has, where are they? Pockets, hidden pockets in here. So yeah, I think it's possibly a little simple, but I really love it and I'm very excited. So I'm gonna get going and I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Love ya. Need joke reaction is fight or flight First sign of color I run and hide But you came like rain on a summer night And I think you're rewiring my mind I've been taking cover under my skin But I wanna step outside and take it all in Baby, it's like a light a storm I just wanted to see the big, 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 big To be house. yours Thunder crash until the sky is torn You're like a light storm A light storm Hello everyone It is currently Saturday and I had such a fun and terrifying night last night terrifying is really dramatic but yeah it was definitely very very out of my comfort zone i was uncomfortable but i had a really good time i'm glad i went owen's here um he came up last night <laughs> i won't so yeah owen and i are currently sitting in marion square park it is very sunny very gorgeous day but we're gonna go home soon and i'm looking forward to it i've had a very nice two days in Dublin. Last night was terrifying and fun all at the same time. I didn't get much photographs though because I was feeling kind of like ah, the whole time and I was pretty nervous and I just couldn't really concentrate but it was very cool. It was very nice watching everybody else. I kind of felt like I wasn't a part of the event. I was just like a spectator and I just kept watching everybody else. It was really fun but I am gonna go I'm gonna head home and edit this vlog for you all. And yeah, I love you all. Bye.